Hey guys, Bluebird35 here, and today I'm going to be doing another unboxing and review, and that's going to be on the the Jack Pacific Motobug. So yeah, um, let's just look at the box real quick. And it says it has two points of articulation, and it even has a little description, and it also has the other figures you can get in the line, so yeah. And um, I'll just read off the description, I guess. The motobug will roll around and try to attack Sonic with its sharp claws, so hopefully Sonic grabs some rings. Okay, so yeah, let's unbox it. Okay, so just real quick, I just wanted to point out that, well, the reason why I got another motorbug, when I literally have three of them already, uh, it's because one of them just, like, I accidentally stepped on one of them and the wheel doesn't roll anymore, so, kind of just wanted another one, but yeah. So, let's just go over articulation real quick, it has three points, right, let's just take the stand, it comes with this nice stand, first of all, but yeah. And also, um, yeah, three points of articulation. Articulation in the wheel, of course. And it has articulation, um, uh, on these little, like, claw things, so yeah. That's pretty neat. I really didn't expect them to add, like, articulation in the claws. They're kind of delicate, though, so watch out. But yeah, they move, they move, they're, they're on a ball joint. Move around. But yeah, um, so sculpt. Jack Civic did an awesome sculpt on it. It looks way better than the Jazz Wears one. I mean, like, way better. I mean, that, I used to think that one was really cool. But until this one came, that thing just blew it away. So yeah. So, the sculpt is fantastic. It looks like straight from Sonic Generations. And yeah. So, then let's size compare. Here's my Jack Pacific Sonic, and, I mean, it does really, I, I mean, I think it's really, that's like how a motobug is supposed to be sized, but, yeah, I mean, the size of it is really, really good. It's very good. So, yeah, that's really good. And, uh, all the size compared to Jack Pacific Tails. And, yeah, so... You can see that they're both, like, really good. Size comparisons are awesome. So, yeah. So, should you pick up the Motobug? Definitely, if you're a Sonic fan, yes. And, I mean, if you want, like, it's it's the best made Sonic Badnik out there. Like, I've seen, like, this is the best looking Sonic Badnik. Well, not best looking, also best... I mean, it has the best articulation, and yeah, these, if they make another bad neck, it'll probably, it'll probably, like, it's definitely gonna be better than the Jazzler's one, but yeah, it's five dollars, um, per motobug, but yeah, that's not a bad price for what you get, I mean, yeah, like, I think that's a really good price, so, yeah, if you're a Sonic fan, get it, definitely get it. Or get a couple, actually. I think I got, like, four of them now. But yeah, your Sonic fan, get them. If you maybe just want more toys to play with, get them. But yeah, this is Blooper, this is Blooper 35 here, and I am signing off. Bye.